Caffeine may be the key to your morning survival, but can it help skin? While I wait to absorb the caffeine from this brew, let's talk about the surprising appearance of caffeine as a cosmetic ingredient. Caffeine is an alkaloid, which is a group of plant-based molecules that contain nitrogen and have a strong effect on the body. You may have heard of its molecular cousins, nicotine, morphine, and cocaine. Caffeine's power to wake you up comes from its ability to block the adenosine receptors in the body, which cause drowsiness. This will make you more alert, sometimes so alert you may even get the shakes. So is there any benefit to caffeine and beauty? I did some research and here's what I found out. It can reduce the appearance of cellulite. Cellulite happens when the fat beneath the skin accumulates and presses up against the connective tissue, forming bulges or dimpling. Caffeine releases the fat stored within the cell and makes that dimpling less noticeable. That's why caffeine is a common ingredient in cellulite creams. Just be aware the improvements are temporary and depend on the amount of caffeine in the product. It may stimulate hair growth. Male pattern baldness, or andronic alopecia, happens when DHT prevents the growth of new hair. Some studies have shown that caffeine counteracts the suppressive effects of DHT and may even improve blood circulation by helping deliver nutrients to the follicle. More studies need to be done, but that hasn't stopped caffeine from making an appearance on the label of several popular shampoo brands. Protect us from sun exposure. Women who've had more than six cups of coffee have shown a 36% decrease in non-melanoma skin cancers. Unfortunately, they couldn't relax enough to enjoy it. Joking aside, recent research has begun to show that caffeine has the potential to raise the SPF of sunscreen and help assist the body by eliminating cells damaged by UV radiation. I didn't find any documented evidence of problems from use of caffeine in skin and beauty products, but as you can see, I did find a lot of interesting research on the benefits. I want to thank Tuscanicazizi, that name, for the great story idea, and I hope everyone has a great caffeinated morning.